what is going on guys this is shank and uh, finally I have the capability to put up this video for you guys um, basically what I want to go over in this video is my save settings from the graphics that I do my rendering settings for Sony Vegas and Cinema 4D so let me open Cinema 4D for that um, so yeah let's get started uh, sorry this video hasn't been put up sooner but I've been really trying to get screen capturing software for probably a week and a half two weeks um, everything I've tried has been really bullshit or has given me a hard time I actually downloaded Camtasia and that even like was messed up so I had to uninstall and reinstall and um, wasn't sure that, that was gonna work but it turned out that it did and I really don't know why I just did that but I did um, alright so basically this is a background that I made for myself about a week ago and it's my current background so basically what you wanna do is you wanna go up to file go down to wait save for web and devices excuse me um, click that and go up here make sure this is PNG 24 sometimes it'll be JPEG um, it'll never be GIF or PNG 8 or WBMP. I've never seen that happen to me before. Maybe it's happened to you guys. I don't know. Um, it's usually PNG 24. Go down to here and make sure this is under one megabyte. I think I know YouTube says like 250k, but it's definitely one megabyte. That is the highest you can go. I think it's actually one megabyte. You can't go over that. I'm not sure don't quote me um so yeah then after that you just save it to wherever you want to save it and blah 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 alright um so that's photoshop um okay ESPN um yeah so go to Sony Vegas Pro 9 I don't use 10 or 11 cuz I hear that it's like the same so there's really no point um you want to go to file down to properties I have custom HD settings set up so that's why it says custom obviously uh, with 1280 height 720 standard HD um, width and height and then you want to go to frame rate click that go down to 59.940 is what I use and it usually is pretty great um, 8 bit for pixel format you don't need to touch that actually I don't think it's gonna let me touch that full resolution rendering quality obviously best motion blur Gaussian deinterlace method blend fields I'm not sure that this matters or this matters, um, but I changed it anyway and it's been fine. Audio, I don't mess around with that. I think I might have changed the bit depth and the resample and stretch and quality. Other than that, everything else is the same. I don't touch any of this stuff. Um, last time I touched it, it was like messed up, and so I don't I don't bother with it. Um, I'm not even actually going to render that video out. There's really no point. So yeah, that's Sony Vegas. Um, really kicking through these. Um, Cinema 4D. I just got R11 or R13. Excuse me. I had a R11.5, I think, but I just got R13, and so it's a little bit different. But luckily, the rendering and everything is the same. So basically, this is your preview. You don't need that to render, but you know it's what it's going to look like. Um, this is rendering the middle buttons rendering and this is your render settings so basically what I usually do is first start up Cinema 4D uh, click that go to width 1280 height 720 um, go to save change the format from a PSD layers to PNG PNG allows good quality and then also no background so it's transparent background um, and you want to click alpha channel then go to file save it wherever the hell you want to as whatever the hell you want um, that does not matter at all and basically that's all I do um, and then I just click render when I'm done and go to wherever and that's that so yeah super duper quick a uh, little tutorial for you guys on how I do what I do and that's pretty much that um, basically as I said earlier I don't know how long I'm gonna have the screen capturing software so it's really just kind of just I don't know just kind of going with the flow and take it from wherever um, I entered or I didn't enter yet but I'm entering the Darth designers competition they're having I guess they're it's up until February 22nd or something like that and basically you make a background for their channel it's got to be partnered and um, the top four people that they like join Darth designs which would be pretty sweet so 
I entered that actually my contest entry is right here but I haven't exactly finished it all the way yet so I'm still working on that um, so I won't be showing you guys that until obviously it's completed um, but expect like a progression for that I'm gonna actually try to start doing a lot more graphic stuff um, mostly progressions maybe some speed arts as I said I don't know if I'm gonna have the screen capturing software so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to to do some speed arts for you guys um I hope I'm able to but you know I, I, I don't know I don't wanna buy it because I think it's probably gonna be pretty damn expensive but you know as I said earlier a hundred times I don't know um that was really weird <laughs> so yeah other than that this has been Shank uh, if you have any questions I will put my Skype in the description that is the best way to reach me at this current moment I mean I answer YouTube but yeah not as much as Skype um, plus Skype goes right to my phone so yeah, I'll put my Skype in the description. Other than that, this has been Shank. I'm out. Peace.